This is CBS 2 News at 6. Well, speaking of this busy travel this weekend, if you like to travel but always hate boarding your pet, no more worries. A new pet resort may just put your mind at ease. The same owner who brought a pet spot to O'Hare Airport has just opened a second location near Midway. And by all accounts, it's fantastic. <laughs> With a splash pool, spa services, and flat screen TVs tuned to Animal Planet, it's the best doggone accommodations you could imagine. I used to travel a lot for work, and I never found a place where I would like to leave them without feeling guilty about, about leaving them behind. That's why owner Sak Nadim opened the appropriately named Paradise for Cause. It's a dog's life when tops on the agenda is several hours of playtime a day. Chase them around, you know, wrestle with them a little bit, you know, maybe even put the boots on, go in the water. You'll find no cages here, instead slumber party suites. And wherever you're traveling, you can keep an eye on what Fido's doing on his vacation. As a pet parent myself, I always wondered what does my dog do all day long when I'm gone, right? So now we have webcams. Wave to mommy at the webcam. Hi, mommy. Hi, mommy. Dooby, dooby, doo. Where are you? But what do you think of your place here? Maybe the cat got his tongue? Feline friends can enjoy eyeballing the fish, a never-ending water fountain, bungalows with a view, and lounging on real tree bark. They each get a couple hours throughout the day uh, where we'll open their door and they can roam through the jungle if they'd like. The staff here is clearly the cat's pajamas, but it's the four-legged visitors who apparently run the place. Hey, come back here with that mic. Hey, not in the water. Yeah, he grabbed it right out of my hand. Paradise for Paws is open 24-7, and this may be the best part. You can leave your car parked there, and they will shuttle you to and from Midway, which is less than a mile away. You may be wondering about the costs. Fees start at $49 a day. And harmony among the animals? Well, they test the animals first, and they group them according to size and temperament. So there are loners and alpha dogs who they separate, who don't get involved in the pack. And the cats don't mingle unless they're from the same family. Just like people, right? Just like people. All 622 right. graduation is supposed to be